Welcome back to Dice Station Zebra, everybody. My name is Rob. And I'm Jocelyn. And today we are playing the Mad Magazine board game from Parker Brothers. 1979. Um, yes, so this might be considered a vintage board game. Right. It's over 40 years old. Mm -hmm. uh, happy April Fool's Day, everybody. We're doing this on April Fool's Day. And because we don't have any tricks or pranks or stunts to pull, we thought we'd do something a little offbeat. So if you're watching this on April Fool's Day, then happy April Fool's Day. Otherwise, enjoy the game. So uh, <clears throat> this is a game, this is a copy, this copy I picked up uh, recently. I used to own this game when it was released early on. I, I don't know if I got it in 1979, but anyway, uh, I'm dating myself. But um, I picked, I lost my copy somewhere along the way. I found this in a vintage shop, so I picked it up. Because why not, right? Mm -hmm. You loved Mad Magazine growing up as a uh, kid. And I still love Mad Magazine. So I still find vintage copies that I purchase every once in a while. And I saw this game and I thought, I can't pass this up because I had this when I was young. So anyway, um, we're going to play a game. Sure. So Jocelyn, you have read the rules. First of all, let's take a look at the board. First of all, the artwork, I just want to say. The artwork, I believe, is done by the cartoonist Jack Davis, who was a... A Mad Magazine. Uh, he was a, one of the main artists and contributors to the to the magazine. Uh, his artwork is um, it's it's very much his own, and I like his artwork. It's very much he's one of the defining figures of Mad Magazine of that era. And yeah, so the artwork is fantastic. So let's take a look at the board. Okay. There's the board. Yeah, we've set it up. <clears throat> it's all ready to go. And you have already dealt out the money. I have. So how much money do we start with? Let's, let's take a look at the rules. Okay. So first off, I would like to say this this game came out before I was born. <laughs> okay. If we're dating ourselves. True. Barely, but yet. Um, and I have never read a Mad Magazine. Okay. I know very little about Mad Magazines. Right. And I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. All right. Jocelyn has no... I played this when I was young. Like I said, Jocelyn has never played this. Yeah. It's a total surprise for her. So we're pretty sure that the rules that were provided in the book were like a photocopy or something that like cut off. Yeah. At the top and the bottom. But the we got rules most of the were rules probably here, so. missing, and so they just replaced them. So the object of the game is to be the first player to lose, repeat lose, all right. your money. And then it says, hey gang, this is a very important word. Okay. Okay. So we have one game board. Yes. We have two dice. Yes. We have four playing pieces. There's two there, plus we set two aside. Yep. Um, and we have play money and card cards. These are card cards. Yep. Which have been pre-shuffled. So essentially, uh, right now I am the banker. Yes. And there's a few rules that are very important um, during this game. So first off, we each have to choose a playing piece and place it on start. So I'm blue. Yep. And I am red. Okay. Uh, each player rolls one die and the lucky dog who rolls the lowest goes first. Okay. So shall we do that? Let's do that. All right. Four. Six. Okay. So Jocelyn go goes first. first. So, uh, it does say, for the playing rules, caution, play at your own risk, especially if you don't yet know the object of the game. Okay. Okay. So, basically, there's a few rules that are really important, and we've already both failed. You're only allowed to roll with your left hand. Well, I roll with my left. Did you? I did. Okay. Whenever you roll with your right hand, each of your opponents gives you $500. Right. But that was just for the... to go... That's who right. goes first. We have to move in a counterclockwise direction right. around the outside track. So the board is very much evocative of Monopoly. Yeah. Except we're not going clockwise. We're going counterclockwise. Yeah. The little start arrow here tells us to. Yeah. No matter what space you land on, you follow its directions immediately. Okay. And then there's some explanations if things come up. Um, there's also a rule here that says Jocelyn gets to uh, make the decision <laughs> uh, if there is a question about the space. Okay. That's not exactly what it says. It says, uh, "Don't fight, take a vote, and take and play according to the majority rule." Okay. But there's only two of us, which means if we disagree, Jocelyn wins. All right, Jocelyn is the judge. The banker. The banker. The banker is the, the judge. The banker. Yeah. Okay. So uh, basically, that's all the things we need to know until we get to there. Okay. Okay. Shall we go? So we shall go. So, so here I have are the to dice. Roll with my left hand. You do. Which is very awkward. Good luck. Good luck to you. Uh, so I go nine? You go nine. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. It says go back to start and then go the total of three rolls. Okay. 
So I go back to start. So does that mean whenever you pass or land here, lose five hundred dollars? So you just landed there. Yep. So I get to lose. Oh, lose first. So we each have ten thousand dollars. Yeah. And the object of the game is to did lose, we say lose all your money? To lose all our money. So we're okay. not trying to make money. We're trying to get rid of our money because it's mad. So I have to go the total of three rolls. The total of three rolls. Okay. So roll number one is eleven. Yes. Roll number two is seven. So that's eighteen. Correct. And another seven. And another seven, so that is 25? 25. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Wait right here for another player to pass you and then move with him or her. So I guess you don't move until I get there. I guess I don't move until I get there. Well, that's crazy. Yep. Okay, so I'm going to go. That's nine. Did I just do the same thing? Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So yep. I go back. Yep, you lose five hundred dollars. Okay. Give five hundred dollars to the banker. Now I have to roll oops, three rolls. Yep. Six. Six. Seven. Seven for so that's 13. thirteen. Okay, another for six 19. for nineteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Tough luck. Tough luck. If anything is under here, you got to take it. Yeah, so actually, um, there was supposed to be $500 there. Oh, there was supposed to be $500 on the tough luck spot. Yeah, I forgot to put that there, okay. but I did read it in the directions. So, I will take the $500 and put that back into my, my stash of money. Yeah, so I believe as soon as the tough luck gets taken, I have to put another $500 there. Okay. So let's tuck that underneath. Yeah. Underneath the tough luck square. Okay. So I guess I keep going until I pass you. Yeah, because it says I wait right there. Yep. All right. I'll go again. 12. Twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six. I pick you up. Seven, Seven eight, eight, nine, nine ten, ten, eleven, eleven twelve. twelve. So I take a card. Yeah. So you can go first because it's your turn. Okay. So. Oh, my God. Are we ready for this nonsense? This card says... Um, if you like this game, cross your legs, sit on your hands, cackle like a chicken, and lose one egg, also $500. So how do I lose an egg? I don't know. You don't have an egg. All right. Can I cross my legs, sit on my hands, cackle like a chicken? So is that what I have to do? That's what you have to do. Oh, my gosh. Remember, you signed us up to play this game. I know. Well... But do you like I, this game? I'm not. Uh, well, I don't know if I like this game or not. So maybe maybe you don't have to do it. Well, okay. I'm going to do it. So okay. Jocelyn will be the judge. Unfortunately, I'm not on camera. So what does it say? Cross my legs. Yep. Sit on your hands. <laughs> Sit on my hands. And cackle like a chicken. Okay. So how does a chicken cackle? Does it go cock, 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 like that? Sure. Cock, 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 cock. There okay. we go. All right. So I lose an egg. <laughs> yes. And five hundred dollars. <laughs> Is that what a chicken sounds like? I don't know. Is that so? You're the judge. I will accept it. Jocelyn accepts it. Okay. So now, I, now it goes on the bottom of the pile, face up. Well, that was mad. Okay. Okay. So now I choose a card. Card. You do? Yeah, because I landed there with you. Okay. If you Why are not? a girl person, win five hundred dollars. I think you're a girl person. Yeah, unfortunately, I am a girl person. <laughs> right about now, I'm wishing that I identified as a they. Yeah. So there you go. Okay. If you are a girl person. Yeah. You win $500. Yeah. You are very lucky to win $500. Okay. See, and you didn't have to cackle like a chicken. Nope. Okay, so um, I rolled the dice last. So does that mean it's your turn now to roll the dice? Yes. Okay. Seems go for reasonable. it. Did you use your left hand or your right hand? I used my left. Okay, that's nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now you pass start, so you so lose five hundred dollars. Now this square says must gamble everything you have. Roll dice. On odd, you win twice as much. On even, you lose everything, but then collect fifteen hundred dollars. <laughs> okay. All right. So I need to roll an even number. Yes. That's, That's odd. A seven. So I have five thousand. Six, seven, 
eight, nine. I have 9,500, so I have to get that twice. So you have to get another 9,500. No, I said, it says you win twice as much. So I actually have to get 19,000. Oh. 9,500, yes. So you take 19,000 out of the bank. I take 19,000 out of the bank. Well, that's unfortunate. Five. <laughs> I don't even know if we have enough. 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Okay. There I we have go. 19,000 extra dollars. Wow. Okay. All right. Your turn. My turn. There's an eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so I passed start, so yeah. I lose $500. So yep. This says go back to start and go the total of three rolls backwards. So you're going to lose $500 again. Okay. So I will trade you a 500 for a 1000 All right. And here we go. Three rolls. Seven. Eleven for 18. 18. Twenty. Twenty. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, so double arrows. Right. Now, one second. That forced me to go backwards, mm -hmm. which is clockwise. What happens? Is that count as, um, does that count as a... I don't think so. It says if you move in a clockwise direction, you're a nerd person and may never play this game again. <laughs> I guess I can never play this game again. Okay, so you landed on double arrows. Yeah. Immediately roll one die with your left hand and yep. move according to your roll. All right. One. Okay. Puts me on this square, which says, go ahead, four. One, two, three, four. One of your 2,000 is counterfeit. Return it to the bank. Okay. $2,000. One of your $2,000 is counterfeit. Return return to the bank okay so there's two thousand yep. dollars it goes to the bank all right and i believe it is your turn okay rolling with the left hand is very awkward for me three one two three if there is an opponent with elbows on the table lose four th two thousand dollars if not lose four thousand no there was no elbows there on the table are no elbows on the table okay there you go one two Three, four. Okay, four thousand dollars. All right, my turn. Your turn. Um, do I keep rolling one die in when I'm in this little box area? Oh, I think I do. Okay, hang on. I think I do. If you start your turn on an inner track, roll one die only. Okay, one die only. There's two. One, two. Everyone, move one chair to the left. Okay. All right. Well, you that become means the banker and you have all the money now. I have all your money. Yeah. You have all mine. Because we do not take our money with us. That's right. Yeah. Okay. I am now here. Okay. Okay. Go. Your turn. Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Looks like you're entering. So I'm entering. Roll one die. Two. One, two. Take a card. Don't peek and give it to anyone else. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, you're anyone else, so there you go. All right. All right, so let's take a look at this card. This card says, if you are a boy person, lose $1,000. But are you a person? I don't know if I'm a person, but I'm definitely a boy, so... Okay. Does that count? I think so. Okay, so it's a thousand dollars of your money anyway. Yeah. So no, it's your money now. Yeah, it is my money now. Uh, okay, it's your turn. Okay. Roll one die. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Take top card, don't peek, and give it to anyone else. Okay. I'm giving it to you. Okay. So let's see what this card says. This card says if you are good looking. Stand up and imitate your favorite animal and lose Okay, well, $2, you're definitely good-looking, so... Well, thank you. Um, you have to stand up and imitate your favorite animal. I don't know what my favorite animal is. Now I have to decide what my favorite animal is? I think a, you like cats, don't you? I do like cats. I like cats better than dogs, so I was going to go with a duck. Then go with a... Is a duck favorite your favorite animal? I just have to make the duck noise, right? <laughs> I'll have to imitate it. Oh, well, imitating a cat is much easier. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go with cat. Okay. Okay. So, um, I kind of feel bad we don't have, like, a, a camera that shows us we at this point. We should have had a camera, shouldn't we? Okay. Okay. 
<laughs> Jocelyn is purring in the best way that she can. So there we go. Does that count? That counts. You lose two thousand dollars. Okay, I think I have to trade in this five. Okay. Here's three back. Okay. All right, and then this goes and on the bottom, face up. It is your turn. Okay. All right, still rolling one die. I guess you have to keep going the direction that you started in. Yeah. Okay. Two. One, two. Everyone one, move one chair to the right. One, two, you're there. One, two. No, this is all the same. Same one. Uh, no, I think that that's a take a card, and that's a different one. Oh, well, I did it wrong then, because I made you do the card. Before. Oh, okay. Then let's play it like that. Okay. Let's play it the way you did it. Everyone move one chair to the right. All right. Oh, you have your money back. We're switching back. Yeah. Okay, now I'm here. Yeah. Okay. No, those are those are separate, so... Okay. I guess moving forward... So you didn't count that when you moved. No. You went one, two. So yeah. I will skip that one. Yeah. Just for... Just to make it even. Okay. It's hard to tell. Yeah. Three. So I will go one, two, three, right? Yep. So I take a card. Yeah. All right. Let's take a look at this card. It says, put a thousand dollars under tough luck. Right there. You put it there? A little hard to read, but yep. Okay. So I take a thousand dollars and I put it under tough luck. Yeah. And then we put that card away. Okay. And it is now your turn. All right. Still rolling with my left hand. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One of your $2,000 is counterfeit. Return it to the bank. All right. Okay. $2,000 goes back to the bank. Okay. Okay. My turn. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Old maid, stay right here until someone rolls a one or seven. I guess I'm stuck. I guess you get to roll it, though, like as part of your own turn. <clears throat> someone includes you. I guess. Four. One, two, three, four. Go ahead, four, it says. So what does that mean? One, two, three, four. It goes that way, you think? Yep. Because that's the direction I'm going. Yep. One, two, three, four. Okay. Everyone moves one <laughs> chair to the right. <laughs> does that mean we trade, we're supposed to trade markers too? I don't think so. We just trade our money? We just trade our chairs and money? It doesn't say that. It no, just says. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Uh, let's see. There is some rules here. Uh, do, 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 do. If you have to switch chairs, don't take your money with you. Right. You it just doesn't say to change your playing piece. No, you just keep your playing yeah. piece. Yeah. Okay. So I'm ba I'm gonna roll. And unless it's a one or a seven. Yeah. Well. Then you don't go anywhere. Well, how does that work? You'd have to <laughs> a one. Oh, a one on the inner track yeah. or a seven. So I have yeah. to roll a seven. Yeah. Hey, look, a seven. There you go. Does that mean I move seven? I think you move seven. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Exchange money with person on right. Ex I, I keep this chair. Exchange the money? I just trade money. Oh. You know, I've been trying to get rid of this money, and it's not working so <laughs> Keeps well. Keeps following you. Okay, it is your turn, Jocelyn. Okay. So that's eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Take a card. Okay. So, this card says, change money with anyone. <laughs> so here's your money. I guess I'm in anyone. All right. Okay. Got, my, got my money back, or your money back. All right. My turn? Your turn. Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now I pass start. So you lose five hundred dollars. So five hundred dollars goes back. If no one is standing, you lose one thousand. If someone is standing, you win two thousand. Oh, Jocelyn for you. is standing. Well, that's because you didn't put a chair in the spot. Yeah, I know. So I just won two thousand dollars. Yep. And it is now your turn. Okay. I'm gonna put a chair in that spot. Four. One, two, three, four. Oh wow. If your name is Alfred E. Newman, collect one thousand three hundred twenty-nine. Nope. One million. $1,329,063. If not, lose a turn. Yep. My name is not Alfred E. And they have included this, this piece of currency, which is a 
one million three hundred twenty nine thousand dollar and sixty three cent bill. Yeah. Just in case your name is Alfred E. Newman, then you will have to take this money. <laughs> Fortunately, neither of us are named that. Correct. So now what happens? I lose Uses a turn. a turn. Okay. So you get to go twice in a row. Yep. Imagine the poor sucker that his name is Alfred E. Newman. He has to take that money. And he's playing this game and has to take it. So I go twice. Yeah. Unless something happens. Here. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Send anyone to tough well, luck. Well, I guess I'll send you to tough luck. Okay, so I have to take this money, and you the banker needs to put five hundred dollars back there. Okay. Which is you now. Yep. And then I go again. You go again. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Change, Change money. money with anyone. Oh, drats. Well, I guess this is less money, so yeah. that's good. Okay, so now I get a turn back. Your turn. Okay. Ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Exchange money. <laughs> oh, swapping money back and forth. Okay, up to you. Ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's a take a card. Okay. Oh boy. You are a rock. Act like one. Yes. If you're good, you lose $1,000. If you're not so good, you win a rock. I don't know if that's rock like it enough for I'm me. I'm acting like a rock. <laughs> All right. How's that? I will accept it. <laughs> it's too bad that wasn't on camera. But yeah. anyway, so do I lose 1000 Uh, You lose $1,000, yes. I'll put 1000 And the card goes here. Okay, my turn? Yep. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Take a card. If you are a boy person, win five hundred dollars. Good. Okay. Fortunately, I'm not a boy person. Yeah, fortunately. Okay. Okay. Fortunately for me as well. Um, okay, so uh, we have an eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Now I passed start. Yep, so you gotta get rid of five hundred bucks. So we lose that. And then it says go back to start and roll go the total of three rolls backwards. Okay, so I'm gonna lose five hundred dollars again. Yep. Here's three rolls. There's a four. four. Fourteen. And Twenty. Twenty. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Roll one die. You did okay. this before. Okay. Yeah. 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Take a card. Okay. Okay. Well, what does this say, Jocelyn? If one or more of the following letters are in your name, you lose the amount indicated. Goat. Yep. So However, I have an, I being have an, a goat, you win $500 anyway. I have O because I'm Rob. And T because you're Robert. <laughs> uh, yes. <laughs> so what do you think? You go by Rob. I so do. you lose $1,000, but then you win $500 anyway. Because I'm a goat. Yeah. Okay, because so. you're the greatest of all time. <laughs> I am. I'm going to put $1,000 there and take five. Yep. And it's your turn. It is my turn. Okay. And i got to lose all your money here. Thank you. Unless I can swap back to you. Okay, I got a nine. So, one, I'm passing go. Yep. Oh, I gotta go back onto the screen here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Place $1,000 under tough luck. All right. Okay. Turn to you. Okay. Two, one, two. If you are magnificent, go to anywhere. All right, well. It's up to you, Jocelyn. Am I, I magnificent? I think you are magnificent. All right, so I'm going to go to anywhere. The anywhere square says, roll a seven, collect $500, and go to start. If you don't, just go to start. Okay. Okay. It's only a four, so I go to start. Which means you lose $500. And I lose $500. Okay. What were you? Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Going into the inside track. Five. One, two, three, four, five. One of your 2000s is counterfeit. Return it to the bank. Okay. Oh, you you're go. low on money. I am. I only have 15 hour bucks left. I need to find a way to swap money with you. <clears throat> That's a two. 
go back to start and go to <laughs> two rolls backwards. So now I got to take five thousand dollars and take forty five hundred dollars because yep. I landed on start. So there's four and then five. Okay. And then I got to do the three rolls thing, right? Yep. Okay, that's so an eight. eight. That's a four for twelve. 12. And, and there's an 11. 11 23. For 23. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Go ahead, the total of one die. 3. 1, 2, 3. Okay. And now I have to enter. Yep. 3. 1, 2, 3. Go to anywhere. I go to anywhere. Okay. okay. Roll, Roll a 7. Yep. It is a seven, so, so I gained five hundred dollars. Like five hundred dollars, and then you go to start. But I go to start, which means you lose five hundred dollars. Right, this game is insane. Okay, over to you. Four, one, two, three, four. Take a card. Okay. Take the next card. Don't peek, and give it to anyone else. All right. Okay. So I have taken the next card. I'm not peeking. And I have to do what it says? Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm going to put it on camera. Yep. It says, stand up and boo the person on your left. Boo, Jocelyn. And lose $1,000. Lose $1,000. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, that was fun. Okay. All right. So it's my turn. It's your turn. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Lose your turn or go ahead 27. If your name is Alfred E. Newman, forget it. Okay, so lose your turn or go ahead 27. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven. And that's why it's twenty-seven. If your name is Alfred E. Newman, collect the one million three hundred twenty-nine thousand dollars and six or sixty-three dollars. If not, lose a turn. So I lose a turn. Okay. Over to you, Jocelyn. Five. One, two, three, four, five. We're doing it this way now, right? Right. Okay. Take a card. Yep. <clears throat> card says change money with the person on your right. I'm wow. not happy with that. I don't want to follow that card. <laughs> You never know, you might get something similar soon. Okay. And Here's you get to go again because I lost my turn. Oh, okay. All right. Three. One, two, three. Take a card. Okay. Card says, this card could only be played on Friday. Well, it is Sunday today. Right. Actually... Right, it's not a, it's not a Friday. So no, it's a Thursday. It's a Thursday. It's, it's a Thursday because it's April Fool's Day. That's why I said it was a Sunday. I was trying to trick you. All right, go ahead. No, I just took two turns. Oh yeah, so it's my turn. Yeah. Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Send everyone else to, to anywhere. anywhere. Oh, I passed start, so yeah. I lose five hundred. Yeah. You're at anywhere. Okay. So now yep. I roll. Yep. And that is not a seven, so I go to start. So you go to start. I lose, lose five hundred dollars. Five hundred bucks. Okay. And it is your turn. All right. That is four. One, two, three, four. Send everyone else to anywhere. <laughs> okay, I'm in anywhere. Look, it's only a six, so I just go to start. Yep. Okay, I'm down to five hundred bucks. 500 bucks. Okay. And it's your turn. Nine. One, no, two, eight. three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Place $1,000 under tough luck. I only have 500. Then you win. I win. There we go. Good game. Good game. This game was more fun than I thought it would be. You think so? Yeah. Um, it'd probably be fun with more people, right? Yeah, with just two people. I mean, it is, it's too playerable. Yeah. But more people will be more fun. You get the flavor of it for sure. Yeah. Um, we are in these pandemic times, so unfortunately we can't have our little friends over <laughs> to play Mad Magazine. No, but this is fun. But this is fine, yeah. Yeah. Well, what do you think? This was, you liked this? I did, it was a lot of fun. Yeah, you I were, didn't know what I was getting into, so. You were a bit skeptical at first, weren't you? I was. Yeah. Yeah. 
Any other thoughts on this game? Um, no, I'm just glad we played. Yeah? Yeah. So there's some crazy stuff, like cluck like a chicken or whatever. Yeah, which I, imitate your I, animal. I think I was horrible at, but, you know. I hey, accepted it. get some friends together on a Saturday night, you know, maybe mix a few cocktails. Next thing you know, say. You're, ha have had martinis. you're having a few last. I would imagine, like, 40 years ago when this game came out, this, you know, that type of thing was, you know, probably fun. Because I don't think there was a lot of those games yet that were out there. Like, yeah. um, what are the games that are out now? Like, um, Cards Against Humanity and... All these games where people, you know, act crazy and yeah. do crazy things. So. Yeah, for sure. Well, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for playing, Rob. Yeah, thanks for playing, Jocelyn. And happy April Fool's Day, everybody. We hope you enjoyed this insane game. And maybe you can find a copy of it at your local vintage store. Yeah. COVID permitting. They're out there, so take a look. Uh, you know, there's even a French version. The other side is French. If you need a um, copy of the rules, we would be happy to scan it and email it to you. That's right. There's a couple of lines missing, but you'll be fine. I'm sure there's some on the internet, too. But let us know what you thought in the comments below. Uh, we hope everyone enjoyed their April Fool's Day. Hopefully nobody did it, played any nasty tricks on you, etc., etc. You know, that stuff gets tiresome, but... So don't forget to like and subscribe. That's correct. And check us out on Facebook, Dice Station Zebra. Yep. And have a good day, everybody. Happy Bye. Wednesday. Bye.